Hey, what is up guys? It is me, Zayden, and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today, guys, we are going to be doing something that is pretty cool. We are building Grian's Hermitcraft Season 6 base on Minecraft. Um, I am doing this on Xbox Edition, uh, but um, that's fine. It's got all the new updates because it's on Bedrock. You can do all the new aquatic slash 1.14 stuff. And um, it, it's going to take a long time, but it's really cool. And obviously, we're not going to do all this in one episode. This is this is a lot of work. It might not look like it, but it is, trust me. Even on creative mode. And it's taking ages to work out where everything goes. But this is like basically my test world, where I make sure I've got everything completely right. And then, only then, I show you how guys how to build it so if something's a bit dodgy at least i can get it wrong on this build and then know how to do it right so uh i guess okay, without guys, further ado, we are now in the building world uh where we're gonna get s some building done as in the name so um we're gonna essentially build a big circle all the way around here um and the materials we're gonna need for this uh, cyan terracotta, white concrete, packed ice, and cyan stained glass. So, um, basically you want to have a big area, and you want to make sure that the area goes at least 20 down, and you want to have, like, a big, like, 20 blocks deep, you want to make sure, and you, and you want to make sure it's a big area, not, like, a tiny area, because the circle, the base, as I'm sure you guys all know, is very big so we need to account for that and um if you are doing this in a super flat world i would definitely recommend you make it a bit more than 20 just um just in case because when i say 20 i mean give or take a few blocks um because it's better to build up a bit than break a bit in my opinion uh and if you're not bothered then that's fine you can just break some of the stuff so we're going to take our cyan terracotta and build up to the surface and we can break all this away. And um, I'm not going to start on this hill because that means I've got to break it all away. I'm going to build out a bit. So we've got this block and we want to make this 11 long. So one, two, let's just check that this is okay. I might, I might move this forward a few blocks just, just to be sure that it won't clash with the hill underwater so one so across one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven there you go and then we want to build another block but make that one go up and then do the same on the other side so this is 11 long so you basically want to build 13 blocks but <clears throat> the 13 blocks you need to 13th block uh you need to build up Okay, Dick. So then we wanna on the eleventh block. You um on this eleven, you wanna uh, go diagonal in front to the um this block and do the same on this side. And you can build this up a good, we'll say good. So one from from sea level, not counting these blocks under sea level one two three four five six seven eight nine yeah nine's a good amount uh actually we'll just go eight we'll go eight i think uh okay so what you want to do is you do that on this side as well uh are these i didn't count that is that the same no we need to go another block up so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that's looking good. And then you want to um you want to build across actually so on the eighth block. You want to build across on the top block, build across, and then you can build across in another one. 
So there we go. This is the uh, doorway sort of thing complete. So um, then just for a bit of extra detail that's not completely necessary at the moment, but it's good to just have for later on. You really want to go up from sea level one, two, three, four, and then go one, and then just go up so it looks like this, and do the same thing on this side, one, two, three, four, there you go. So you should have this at the moment. So then we're going to start building the circle. I'm not going to build it up yet. We're just going to build the kind of outline of the circle. So we're going to go. Another diagonal, but instead with white concrete. And we want this to be three long. And then, uh, oh yeah, by the way, here you can go out and kind of just build around this bit. So we'll just do that quickly. Um, there you go, that looks good. So then you got three here. Actually, on second thought, I think we might build this up. So one, two, three. You want it to build it up four. Then we want to go back one. So it's so you should have a kind of here three by oh wait that should be one higher. So three by four square here, and then that's going to go along here. Uh, then you want to do the same thing but one back diagonally. So, whoops, uh, like this, so three by four, and then we'll build this uh, cyan terracotta. And you can already see how it's beginning to kind of look like his base. Bear in mind, it would take a while. And this, this will be a fair amount of work, but once it's done, it will look awesome. And of course, he hasn't finished the interior yet. Um, so that we have to do at the end because <laughs> I have no idea what it looks like at the moment. It's a bit cluttered at the moment. So then we go, instead of three, we go two this time. And then we go, keep building the uh, cyan terracotta round. And then another two. Uh, so... And then on top of this white concrete, we are going to add ice, but don't do that yet. Cause, um, so then we go, so yeah, uh, we need to build this out another one. So it's two. So you got, uh, so one, two, three, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, then one, two, one, two, three, four, then one, two, one, two, three, four. Then one, two, one, two, three, four. Then you want to do one more two. So, like this. So, you should have this. So, this is kind of the first part of the circle, if you like, done. Which is very, definitely very good. And then, we're going to want to build up another uh, cyan terracotta next to this too. And then we're going to go diagonally back into the right one so it should look like this there we go and um, we're not going to build it up yet we're going to do that at a later stage okay yeah so we'll do that later but um for now i guess we should just continue creating this kind of circle so uh, let me just have a check yes that's correct so okay so you're gonna go here you're gonna do another diagonal here and this is gonna be a bit more kind of uh, there's not gonna be twos it's like or threes it's gonna be ones on this part so you're going to go diagonal to this, like this. And of course, we, we're going to continue this. Then we're going to want another diagonal one. So it's just one, two, three, four, but just ones. And then another one. So at the moment, you have three ones. And you want to create three more of these. Another one. And there we go. 
So at the moment we have one, two, three, four, five, but we actually want six. So there we go. We have this one, two, three, four, five, six. That's very good. So continuing on with this. That's very good. So just check this to make sure you've got everything correct. And um, then we want to do another diagonal, but with uh, cyan terracotta and um, another cyan terracotta. So you kind of got this same thing. And then we're just going to repeat this pattern and this. So I'm just going to do it a little bit faster than before, just so you guys, because you, you guys have seen me done, you guys have seen me do this before. It's just the same thing, so we want to go uh, in the same bit as this. No diagonals, just exactly the same as this. We want to go two and build this across. But instead of going backwards diagonally, you want to go forward. Self-explanatory again, because that's how circles work. <laughs> then you want to go another two. Keep building this bit. Then another two, like this, and then that's good. So now you want to go for another two, again. And again, if you're stuck, you can kind of just check this bit over here and be like, oh yeah, I hear that works like that. Um, so you can do... So then we want to do the threes again. So one, two, three. Again, it's four tall or five if you're counting from under sea level. Whoops. <laughs> Made a bit of a mess of that. And then three again. There we go. And um, so you kind of got this sort of thing. I'm going to build another arch. And then I think you guys will just be able to I mean I'm gonna I'm just gonna go I'm gonna speed up the video a tiny bit so you guys can still see what I'm doing and uh, but you also if you kind of know how to do it it's not tedious for you guys um, and of course at the end I'll pan over it just so you can check that you made no mistakes and uh, of course like even at this point I'm kind of going back to check if it's correct because it's um got to be symmetrical otherwise look a bit weird <laughs> so we're going to do the same thing as before we're going to build it up one two three four five um uh wait <laughs> how how much did i build this up uh so that's one two three four more so eight so one two three four five six seven eight and then across i'm gonna go eleven one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven then one up then of course in front a bit and we're gonna build these up eight so one two three four five six seven and eight yay so Build another archway, and then there we have it. So that is looking good, and we'll just build this to make it a bit more accurate. I think I think I might have done that a bit wrong. Oh no, that's right. Yay! Yeah, that is good. Uh, actually, I think we will just do this a bit we want to make this for the archways you want to extend this a bit so it's four instead of three and then we want to create oh <laughs> whoopsies then we want to create uh wait give me a second sorry we want to create five actually Okay, sorry about that, guys. I, w I thought I'd done something wrong, but everything's fine. 
do not alright so this is gonna be five long uh, but we're gonna actually we're gonna we're gonna extend this out a bit so it's gonna actually be more like four long and one you you you'll see what I mean in a minute but don't worry about that for now just make it five long into here we'll do the same for this but oops oh uh, okay doing a bit of swimming there uh, we'll extend this to here. Okay, so I'm going to speed up this bit a little bit. And I'm going to build around here a little bit quicker than I did here. So starting from here. And I'm going to speed this bit up. But not by much. So you can still kind of see what's going on. So let's do this. <laughs> Okay guys, hello again. Uh, so obviously I haven't finished yet, but um, we're at about the halfway point and I would definitely recommend, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, oh whoops, did that wrong. But um, anyway, um, even if you didn't do this wrong, I would definitely recommend checking that everything matches up with this side. For example, that this is in the same place as the other one. So checking your coordinates and kind of just going across and wait, might might be worth in joke you don't move out of place. So see if this part is on the same bit. So I know that I'm on here. I'm on four three sixteen. Uh, this is also on four three sixteen. So I know that I've done this correctly. But obviously, I've done this bit wrong. Um, so four three twenty six. I can tell. No, that's one block off. It's because I did the arch a bit too close in. So yeah, I definitely recommend checking, and then you can kind of go around and just double check what your issue is with the um, thing. Just a simple miscount. I'd recommend doing this on each corner on each kind of half that you can just to make sure because if you get if you get if you don't and it turns out it's wrong it takes longer to fix and stuff so yeah okay so let's just continue and i'll stop rambling on
Okay then, so we have completed the circle, which is very good progress. So it's looking pretty good. And I guess you guys can begin to see that it is coming or it is really coming on. And um, if you want to, you can just kind of go around the edge uh, doing this on the inside as well. Because that's what's going to have to happen. And <laughs> you might have seen in the time lapse we were joined by a wandering trader. Uh, which is very good. <laughs> and a few dolphins as well. Which is good. So let's uh, just go around here placing these locks. I think we're going to finish up soon. Because uh, I don't want this to take too long. Um, so yeah. I, I, I'd rather go through this really slowly and carefully um and take uh quite a few uh lots of episodes then go through it really quick and you guys be uh being confused and not really knowing how to do it properly and possibly making mistakes so i would rather do it this way um so yeah that's nearly done with this it's just just a little detail that's in the base that we might as well add now. Um, so, I'll just quickly slowly, well, quickly slowly. <laughs> I'll just slowly pan around the outside so you guys can see how it looks. If you've made any mistakes, you can correct them. So, two, 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 three, three. I'll show you the blocks as well. So, this bit, remember this, oh, whoops. This bit should be 9 here. And then if you count this block, 11. Um, 3, 3, 2, 2, 2. 6 ones, 2, 2, 3, 3, 3. 9, 3, 3, 2, 2, 2. You get the idea. So, there we go. That. So I think we're going to finish up for today. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope we'll be able to. <laughs> there we go. Hope we'll be able to do a lot more of this base, and it's already beginning to take shape. And we've done the main circle, which is good. Next episode, hopefully, we'll be able to do the whole first layer, adding in the packed ice and stuff as well. So, um, yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Remember to like and subscribe as well. That would really help out the channel a lot. See you later.